Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. Um, really exciting video um, to show you today because I am going on holiday and last week or two weeks ago I filmed a holiday haul. Um, if you know my channel, you'll know that when I don't film for, literally if I have a week's break, I get really nervous, even though I've done this for years and I like, I'm like short of breath, even though I haven't been doing anything at all. So it's Sunday and I wanted to finish off that video that I planned and that was all about getting my skin ready and prepped for my holiday and for the summer and I've been really working a lot on my skincare. So I'm going to show you some skincare. Um, something really exciting with that to, to share with you. Amazing products, really good prices, um, really good concept that I think you're all going to love. Then you're going to look at all the holiday wear, which is 90% high street prices, like high end high street prices, I would say. Um, and then a few designer pieces that stand the test of time that you can mix in with all your other bits. So I'm getting nervous because. Um, I'm going to say this so fast that my brain doesn't even know, know how to process it and I'm going to be very matter of fact because I'm not at all there yet but for those of you that follow me on Instagram you know that something happened, I lost someone, something really dear to me so um, not going to think about it la 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 I love thinking about honorary dancing so that makes me really happy um, yeah I'm not in no way Oh God. Literally, the only thing that gets me out of this is when I watch this video of Honoré dancing. I shared it on um, I shared it on stories once. It's so funny. I mean, I should have ha I should have had it um, prepared. Uh, yep. Yeah, so I'm gonna do it whilst I'm looking at my phone with pictures of Oni. But yeah, I'm not gonna address it. I'm not there yet. So um, and that, for those of you that don't follow me on Instagram you'll be like, what is she going on about, and it's, you're none the wiser, but yeah, give, give me, it'll be a few months, I will not be able to talk about it for a few months, um, the, the holiday haul that you saw, that was obviously before, and I've got about three videos going out that were before, so if it's confusing, yeah, I just didn't want to like go on as if nothing had ever happened, because obviously it did, so anyway, let's get into the video, just wanted to quickly swoop past that. Um, so let's get, get get into the video. Sorry, a bit of a panic there. Um, I just put some like bronze on my face because I used a new tinted moisturiser today and I used the one that I think I should have used the the darker side, uh, the darker one as opposed to the light one. So my face is a little bit light, but my skin is so amazing at the moment. I've transitioned from foundation to tinted moisturiser, which is such a big deal, especially when you're like probably from early 30s before, like it doesn't really matter, but I normally feel like I have to wear foundation all the time now and I really hate it, so uh, I'm at the level with my skincare now where I can just go back to a tinted moisturiser and it, I think it looks really good. New jeans as well, got these sent um, by frame, I'll try and find them below to link, but skincare, let's talk skincare, so we are going to talk about the beauty website, Beauty Pie, I love that name, Beauty Pie. Um, I actually discovered Beauty Pie through one of my friends, which is the best way, I think, to discover something. A friend, someone that you trust, just anyone that you trust, even if it's an influencer that you really trust. Um, so already I went in with some, some confidence, and when I started looking at the website, I thought, okay, this is really, really new. It's a, Let me explain the concept first about Beauty Pie. So Beauty Pie, to put it plain and simple, it's... A beauty company that goes straight to the lap so essentially they're cutting out the middle one and at first I was like for beauty because I've never heard of that before but when you think about it we're renovating our house and what is the one thing you do when you're renovating your house you try to get the materials straight from you know instead of going via a fireplace company that deals with someone in Italy I'm going straight to Italy so it makes sense through everything else in the world except for beauty. So I thought, okay, so let me have a look. The prices, I had to keep reading them because I was thinking, you know when you see serums and face cream, aging face cream and eye cream, they are so expensive and the ones that I love, that I think work really well, 
they are a minimum, I was going to say £100, but I actually don't have anything under £200 because I really need something to work. The prices will blow your mind and I did so much research into this and I never show you anything beauty without using it for two weeks, that's my rule. And even when I'm using the product, you can feel in the consistency like the textures, when you're rubbing it into your face, you can feel that the quality is there. Um, so the way that it works, they cut out the little man, they go straight to the lab, um, and there's also a membership. Again, that is something that I thought that initially thought was really odd, but then everything I love in life, I have a membership for, for whether it's Netflix, the gym, Cosgo, furniture stores, everything I have with a membership, so it just makes sense. It, it's a new concept, but actually it makes perfect sense. So I used the product for two weeks. I've got some hero products that I love. I'm gonna touch on makeup ever so quickly, um, just because there there isn't, like, I have never said this before, but I have a Holy Grail Beauty makeup product in this video, and I've never said that before. I do not say that lightly. Um, so I have that to show you, but let me know if you'd like me to do a makeup version of this video, because it's skincare. Um, so I picked products that I could use all in one skincare regime, and that's what I've done this morning. So I'm going to leave you with that little video so you can see the step-by-step -step of what I did, and then I'll quickly talk you through each product. This should hit the spot. Emergency pimple patches. They are so good. They are unbelievable. So I didn't keep mine on for the full two hours, which you should. I've used one before. I actually used it before I went to the pre birthday party. And I had it on all night. So you can wear these all night or at least two hours for the, the product to like oxidise in the skin. They are amazing. Read all the um, ingredients of these products and it will add up like why they work so well. And I've never had something that's a pimple patch that stays on all the time and actually makes a difference. So really recommend that if you have an emergency, like an event or a photo shoot, they're, they're really, really good. Um, might not take it away completely, but it's the best thing that I've used and it's something that stays on because it's sealed. So it's amazing. Next, I used a cleanser. Now, I have to be honest with you, I've only used this cleanser twice, um, not the full two weeks. And the reason being is because I had the green one, Plantex or something is what I put the picture here. I used that one and I had that way before I'm doing this video and I completely used it all and I just wanted to try something different. So this is the Super Healthy Skin Hot Oil Double Cleansing Balm. Now the other one I can really recommend and I love that one because it's so light. Um, so you don't have to really rub on your face, uh, really important if you've got dry skin, you've got eczema or you've got aging skin because you don't want to be dragging product all around, it's phenomenal. I've used this twice, well third time today um, and I'm loving this one as well. If you look at the consistency, this one is does feel really really light as well, it glides across the face. Sometimes balms can make me break out, this one is amazing um, and I don't know whether because they wanted to save money on the packaging that they've gone super minimal 
because um, they want to keep the prices down, but I absolutely love the packaging of Beauty Pie. It's so minimal. It, it's, it does feel feminine, but it's definitely masculine as well. Um, oh God. Oh God. Now I've got serum all over my pink marble. Wait, we have a crisis. I need to get rid of this. Okay, next that we're going to talk about is this toner. And I haven't had a toner that I've liked for a long, long time. This is Pure Purifying Glow Toner. Um, I think if you follow me on store on Instagram, I'm going to share the benefits as well. I'm going to put it in a list of each of my favourite products. Okay, so this is Pure Pore Purifying Glow Toner, and it is so glowy. I have to be careful with toners because I find that they really sting my skin. I don't know whether it's a mixture of my eczema or um, dehydration, but sometimes I just go to put it on and I think, oh, I don't want that pain today. This one is amazing. I don't get that pain, that stinging feeling that I normally get, and it is super glowy. Even when I'm putting it on, I felt like, you know, when you can just feel like it's going to work well. Um, and again, love the the simple packaging of this so I use that next the glowy toner um, and that's really good if you do have larger pores um, and it will it will make them smaller and this one I'll quickly talk about because I don't use it in my morning routine but this is the plantastic this goes with the the balm that I was telling you about this is overnight miracle face oil so I use this every night and I have it you know your skin really needs a lot of good treatments during the night because that's when our skin repairs and I love an oil, um, so that's what I use before I go to bed and in the morning. Okay, now after that I will use the Japan Fuse Fusion Genius Lift. That was quite difficult to say, so um, love the little pink bottle. What is it about beauty products that are pink? I think everyone feels drawn to pink beauty products. Um, I love the smell of this, all the oils and the serums, I love the smell of them. This I massage all up my neck. Massage it, I take a couple of minutes massaging, I let it rest, um, and then I love the so I want to get the names right for you so I'm not confusing super drops, super drops, brightening and oxygenating. So, whenever I get facials, I always have an oxygen blast, I think it will work so well for the skin. Um, and my skin always feels dull if I don't pay it attention. Um, and after all of this combined, I feel like my skin, the dullness has gone, I feel glowy, I feel bright, I feel dewy. And I think that you can see that for yourself, especially because I've not got a foundation on, I've only got a, a beauty tint on. So I'm realising over the years that the more I pay attention to my skin, the less I have to worry about doing the makeup. And having skin, good skin is such a confidence booster. Um, so I, you, I can use one of these on their own, depending on how much of a rush I'm in, or I do leave a gap in between, like a five minute gap, and I do like using these together. It really works well for me. Um, <clears throat> and then finally, oh, I've got to talk about the mask. Um, I love a sheet mask. Whenever I've got a photo shoot, I always do a sheet mask. I think they're really hydrating, really soothing. And what I can tell you about Beauty Pie is that I really have such sensitive skin for my eczema. You know all about it. Um, and everything is super soothing. This is the Uber Youth Multi Collagen Sheet. So that is a winner. An absolute winner. Absolutely love this mask. I'm going to buy them in bulk for every time I have a photo shoot. Um, then lastly, I have the moisturising cream, which is the ultimate ageing, anti-ageing cream, lifting, firming and plumping. This is amazing. It's so simple. Um, and I'm over the moon about this because the face cream that I love that reminds me of a similar texture, I'm not going to say the name, I don't think that would be allowed. Um, but it costs hundreds and hundreds of pounds to the point where I was going through it so quickly because it's such a small tub and it, it was so expensive and I like to use a lot of moisturising cream because of how dry my skin is. This to me feels so similar to that. The texture, it feels just so like buttery and light. The formula is amazing and it is so soothing and I really feel like it does exactly what it says. It's, I really feel like it was plumping and firming. Um, just a really natural moisturiser, so this is a winner for me. Not the Holy Grail product, but pretty much up there. Um, 
And I'm so confident recommending these to you because they really work and the prices are amazing. So it's a win-win. You do have to join up as a membership. Um, I think if you really are into your skincare and you want to do step by step, step in your, you know, from toner to eye cream to moisturizer and the skin, the makeup, and you're doing it every morning and every night, then maybe they'll go up a tier. Um, the lipstick that I'm using, I find it so hard to get, oh, should I go back a bit? I've probably been in, in your face a bit, haven't I, the whole time? Um, I find it so hard to get a nude lipstick. I find that they're either too brown or too pale. Um, this one is Beige Baby. It's actually quite a rosy colour. I would, I would say it's like a rosy beige. And I can imagine that this colour would suit so many skin tones. In the video that we did have seen, I just wore it, no lip liner. And what I was trying to show you in that video is to have glowy skin, just put on a quick brow, a quick lip and go out the door. And I would have felt really, really confident and natural. Just super glowy, dewy skin. Little bit of natural colour on the lips and some some brow to keep your face alive. This would be my go-to if I'm rushing out of the house or running to work and, um, you know, I'm not meeting anyone new but I don't want to look like I'm dead. Uh, or school run. That's the kind of vibe that I was showing you for that. So that's the lipstick. Um, really moisturising but a matte texture. Absolutely love that. Um, I've actually lost my makeup bag. I don't know where it's gone. Um, so I'm putting a whole make new makeup bag together for my holiday. Anyway, talking way too much. Now, the Holy Grail product, I've never said that, that those words on my YouTube channel and I have reviewed a lot of beauty products, um, whether it's on a campaign or organic. This is amazing. So I have been looking, and I'm always looking for a good brow product, so that's what this is. Let me tell you the exact name. Archology Eyebrow Sculpting Gel. And I thought, I liked it because I liked the, the brush. I thought it was very small, dainty, so I can be accurate. It just looked good, but I didn't have high hopes because I am so picky when it comes to an eyebrow product. My eyebrows are not bad at all. Like, I have hair there, um, but I do get bald in patches. And I try and stay away from pencils because when I'm rubbing and rubbing and drawing on, I find that it's losing the hair. So I like the brushes the best. Um, and I just thought this would be a very quick, like, fluffing up. It's amazing. It does more than just brushing up. Like, I just wanted it for a quick every day, like a little bit of colour, a little bit of brush. This looks to me, what are those brows that everybody's getting? It's completely gone out of my mind, but the brows that everyone's, HD brow, no, I forgot what it's called, um, where it's all fluffy and it stays like that. It's completely left my brain. I felt like it did that instantly, so it completely made it stay, but it wasn't really sticky or over soapy or over trend, because I don't want to go over trend on the eyebrows. It gave a lot of colour, so normally I do pencil and a brush, and I felt like this was more than fine together. Um, I don't want to go on it too much, but when I say to you, trust me, this product is amazing, because I do not say these words lightly on my channel, because I want you to trust me. I don't want you to ever me say, go get this, it's amazing, and it's not. Try this, the price is extremely reasonable and I know you're going to love it. And when I recommend things to you, like obviously I'm happy when I've seen that you've got it and I know that you're happy with it, but then every now and again I recommend a product, whether it's clothes, shoes, beauty, and you'll actually go out of your way to message me saying, wow, it really is amazing. I know that's going to happen with this because it's the best eyebrow product that I have. It does everything, makes it stay in place, gives it colour, and it's fast and on the go. So I literally can just have this in my makeup bag and not pencils and powders. So absolutely love that. So they're all the Beauty Pie skincare that I wanted to show you. So that's my morning routine. Plus I wanted to show you the pimple patches that I don't use every morning. And the Miracle Night Oil because I want to be as best I can when I wake up. And then just a little touch on the lipstick and the eyebrow, and if you would like me to do a full makeup review for Beauty Pie, please do let me know. I'll go through a lot of the products and then I'll pick out my favorite and I'll do a makeup look for you. Um, let me know if you want it to be day or evening. So that's the that's the that's all the beauty part. Um, everything will be listed in the link below. Any details, you know, if I've ever got discount codes or anything like that, I'll put them in the description box below with the direct links. Um, 
And now we're going to go into my holiday, everything I'm taking on holiday. There's some really phenomenal pieces and I'll leave you with that second half of the video. So as you've already seen, this is a summer holiday haul. I'm gonna be trying everything on. Uh, for those of you that followed me for a while, you may have remembered that I did something similar two years ago for our baby moon, which never happened for obvious reasons. So same holiday, we're going to the Seychelles. Uh, super excited, a little bit nervous about Travelling, does anyone else feel like that? Because although we went to France last summer, we drove there, we went to the place that we always go to, we worked the whole time, it didn't really feel like a holiday and it definitely wasn't long haul, so yeah, a bit anxious. Um, if anyone felt like that and it all went well, let me know. Um, so, I want to be a little bit more strategic with this video. Instead of just showing you all, all my new summer bits, this is what I'm taking on holiday, I actually, two things I wanted to discuss. One, I spend less in the summer and I buy less luxury in the summer so I wanted to show you the key pieces that I have every single year that I never rebuy, really buy unless they fall apart which isn't normally the case or my weight changes which is normally the case that's definitely what's happened this year so the key pieces that you just invest in this one time you can rely on using it every single summer throughout the summer on holiday um, works from city to beach these things and then you just buy your little bits, you know, we always want like the odd little thing, don't we, for our holiday, whether it's, I don't know, a trend little dress or colour or just something that feels a bit new for holiday. So that's what this haul is going to be about, as well as, which I wasn't going to mention, but I definitely think I should, I don't know what that's doing there, um, and that is um, my way. I had a really nice discussion with, with a lot of people on Instagram. Just a disclaimer, I, it, I feel fine about my way um, and I feel like when you want to be a mum, for example, so badly like me, it's such a small price to pay and the appreciation weighs out any negative thoughts that I have. But at the same time, like my body has changed a lot. I haven't been, I, I've had my Peloton six months and I've been on it twice. So I'm not doing anything about it. I'm not even dieting. So I feel like when I'm in that mindset, which I hope comes soon, because I'll feel better, you know, with endorphins and things working out. Um, I'm happy, I'm, I'm at peace with it. But like many of you, when our weight changes or we, we, we become new mums or even having a second or third baby, our body changes, it all changes with our age, when we have babies. Um, so I'm dressing for my new body and a lot of the pieces, because I've always worn baggy clothes, I can still get away with it. But um, just a little message to anyone that's body has changed or you become a new mum or you've just had a baby, don't be hard on yourself. Like I said on Instagram, we're more worried about what other people think than actually being happy ourselves. So that's just a reminder, your health is everything, your babies are everything, being happy is more important, um, and just do what makes you feel good. And just adapt. Um, what I will say is don't go out and buy loads of new summer clothes straight away. Um, you know, because your body might change again, especially if you've had a baby. So, that's the intro. Um, also want to be really clear that some of the brands I'm mentioning, I have worked in the past, it's pretty much the case with everything. This is a mixture of items that I bought full price, some at a discount, and some were gifted. Um, not by any means an ad, but just wanted to make that clear. If you're ever unsure of my videos are ads or not, just look in the description box below because it, everything will be declared in that description box. So, uh, let's talk about the luxury pieces because um, I have the fewest of them, few luxury pieces. Um, you'll have seen these on Instagram, so do make sure you follow me on there because I feel like something's running low on stock. I'll share it on Instagram before the YouTube video goes out so you get a chance to buy them. Now this, as you will all recognise, is um, Missoni shorts and trousers. I did also buy the dress and a top and a swimsuit. Normally I would have filmed the video and showed you and then sent it back, but I, I didn't have time to film and I'm in a rush to get the items back for my holiday but they didn't fit so I've just exchanged for the same size um, I'll put up a picture and link below the pieces that I got um, but I do still have the shorts now this exact uh, print exact color colors I had before I bought I can't remember but I think it was around eight seven or eight years ago I had the shorts the headband the bikini and a dress and they were an Italian size eight like I've got them upstairs and they are like half the fabric of these it's crazy 
and I always say this, it's crazy that at the time I was worrying that I was fat and I'm wearing an Italian size A and my message to anyone is be happy with your body because I'm, I'm sure that in 10 years time I would love to have the figure that I have now so I'm really listening to my own advice um, and I'm going to keep them in case I have like a niece or a daughter or a daughter-in-law and I'll, I'll give them away. So I invested into these uh, seven or eight years ago, wore them every single holiday. They would be my go-to that I would always throw in the case. I wear them all the time. I wear them on the beach with a bikini or you can wear like a linen shirt um, or a denim shirt and they're just so good for all year, all, all summer and all throughout the holiday. So I got these and the trousers. I've never had the trousers like this. My other ones are long ones which still fit because their waist is elasticated. I absolutely love these and then they had some jogger version which were cheaper actually so I'll link them below. So they're the Masoni bits. Then I just wanted to show you something like this which I got last summer. I actually got it at the end of the summer but I knew I'd wear it this year. And that is my Fendi shirt which also comes with the matching shorts. Sorry, it's creased. It was at the bottom of my um, drawers because it's been away for winter. This is sold out but I'm going to link similar pieces because something like this is an investment. But I can wear this in spring with a pair of jeans. I can wear this... Um, over a bikini, top tip for your holiday, always pack a white shirt, just a plain classic white shirt. Um, one that I've been wearing a lot lately is just a high street one, so I will link that because I love it. Just get one a little bit longer or, you know, a men's one. I tend to like the oversized women's one because they're a bit longer at the back. They're the most flattering thing to wear around the pool, I think, like nice and covered up. But then you can wear them with a pair of jeans. Definitely always pack a white shirt for the holiday. And it's one of my favourite pieces for summer. Um, but yeah, something like this, I can wear it in the evening with a skirt around the pool. I can wear it with the shorts. I can wear it with denim shorts, like black denim shorts. I can wear it with the Missoni pieces. So I always get something like that because I start wearing it now in spring. And it's just a nice little luxury. So they're the luxury pieces. Now the next lot that I'm going to show you um, are pieces from Outdazzle. Outdazzle is a brand that I have loved for ages. And as soon as we booked our holiday, I went into like a panic. That, oh, I'm buying holiday clothes. My body has changed. I need a whole new wardrobe. And then I got overwhelmed with the time and where am I going to get everything. And then I straight away went to Outdazzle because they have a variety of things. You can get anything from heels to, sh to um, like fancy heels. I bought, uh, are they up there? Yeah, I'll show a cutaway. But I love the Mac by Match by Match shoes. Mac Match by Match shoes. I actually bought them. And I thought they were really overpriced because they wasn't comfortable. And I love luxury shoes for the comfort and how they feel. And they did not feel luxury enough, comfortable enough for that price. So I returned them. And then a few months later, Outdazzle had like a dupe version. And I love them. They're actually comfortable. They're lower. So you can get like fancy heels. You can get sliders. You can get trainers. You can get frilly dresses, beachwear. They literally have everything. So I got my... New Missoni set that's going to last me forever, I think, because I've bought it in a big size. And even if I lose weight, it'll be fine. And then um, I literally got everything else at Outdazzle. And I do work with Outdazzle. Um, so I have like this ongoing discount code. So I'll put that across the screen. I'll also put it in the discount below because it works across the whole sites. 15% uh, off, which is the biggest discount you can get at Outdazzle. And they have a range of brands like Philly Boo, Love Shack Fancy, you're not going to get new season stock for 15% off and then they have like lower price points um, and like random new brands. So one of the brands that I'm so obsessed with that I've never discovered before is Mushi by Mouchet, I think that's how you say it, it's just here. Um, really reasonable price point and I got so much from this brand and everything I'm going to show you I'm very conscious of my arms I do not like showing like here and above but then I have to be really careful what I'm buying because I don't want to be covered up wearing like long sleeve like this all the time so this was the most is the most amazing flattering uh like cool to wear as in like heat cool it's not too covered up blouse it's really original style it's got 
the flare sleeves that come to the elbow, so really flattering, really perfect if you're conscious of your arms. And then it's quite cropped, but because it's wired and goes out with a frill, it covers up this area, which I'm not conscious of, but it's the worst the worst part of my body, my tummy and my arms. So it's a nice blouse that covers up those areas. These come with, I've got everything here. Um, this comes with like a little, this is amazing, like skorts, so 90s. So it comes with these, which is the best thing ever because if you follow me for a while, you know that my summer wardrobe is full of frilly dresses like this. Like the standard Love Shack fancy one. I've been wearing that brand for years before it even came to the UK or came to any stockist in the UK. And I still love them. I still have a new one this summer. But for every day, I wanted, I never thought I'd, I could find one in Scorts, but with, with Honoré, my son, I'm always bending down. I'm always playing on the ground with him, like lifting up on the slide. So this is perfect. So I still get that look, but I'm not going to be flashing because it's short. Most amazing ever. So that goes with those short skorts. And then I have this blouse, which also is a part of the set where you buy them all separately. Um, and it's a lovely blouse that I can wear now in the spring with a pair of jeans with my Isabel Moran sheer lingerie which you've just seen. I can start wearing it now already. But I love packing this kind of thing for holidays because I just get so much wear out of them. And I love packing two-piece sets. Oh god, I don't know why I'm out of breath today, but I am. Um, well, obviously I have asthma, so that would be why, Claire. Um, it's like I've been running around, but I haven't. Um, oh, that's thrown me. So yeah, two pieces so that I could get a whole look out of this with the skorts. I could then wear it with a pair of denim jeans. I can then wear it with a skirt and, you know, wear a pair of earrings like this. I try to limit as much as the pieces that I'm packing. So really good, really good piece to pack because you can mix and match. So that's one thing. I then got the exactly the same in lilac. So, and they do this in another colour, which is a really on-trend colour. I'll link that below. It's really nice. I actually only saw it when I was linking this, but um, I love a bit of pop of colour because as much as I love white and it looks so good when I have a bit of a tan, I am one of them people that always stain white and I always want a bit of colour when I'm on holiday. So, a huge fan of lilac and this is going to go so nice with my pink Chanel bag or my pink... Um, Baby Pink Hermes Constance, that's going to be a really nice pop of colour. Again, I can mix and match. I think this will be really nice for like my black leather skirt if I want to do more of an evening look. So definitely recommend, recommend this brand. Or even these with like a white t-shirt or a linen skirt. Imagine that with a white linen shirt, sorry, like for the beach. And then in the evening, I can wear it with that. So many outfits and I could pack very little. Um, so definitely check out this brand, uh, it's really reasonably priced and then you also get the 15% discount so definitely worth it. And this is my ultimate fave piece that I've got for summer for so many reasons, we'll talk about the denim in a second. Um, this is a brand that I've seen before, Miss June, really reasonably priced Miss June. Uh, there are, are some pieces that are a bit more pricey so don't forget to use the discount code. This is a, I'm sorry if I'm not full blown showing you like uh, the swimwear and things like that, it is not happening. Like even if someone offered me a mini Kelly, I would not be parading around on YouTube in a swimsuit. I'm just not quite there yet. So I'll put up as many pictures, check out the links. Um, and then I'm going to be taking some um, like selfies in the mirror and showing them on Instagram. So you'll be able to get a better look there. Um, now this is amazing because it's something that I can wrap around. I don't need to fit in like tight and squeezy and I can wrap around and have it at my own comfort. It covers everything at the back. It's all frilly and poofy so I'm hiding anything that I feel a bit um, like that I want to hide. But then it shows a bit of the leg as much or little as you want. So such an amazing flattering piece if you're if you want to be slightly covered up but still look really nice, this is the skirt for you. I'm so excited. And anyone that I've seen this on, all different shapes and sizes, it looks so good on everyone. 
if you're slim petite and young it looks so amazing with like a little bikini top and then if you're someone that's you know you've got a baby bump or you're post baby like me it's so flattering I'm a huge fan and then that comes with a really beautiful off the shoulder top again very flattering I love off the shoulder because it covers the top of your arms you've got all your uh, collarbone showing so it's a nice balance and then it's kind of ruched at the bottom so when I have it on it's all ruched and baggy around the tummy so it's so flattering and if you wanted to wear them with a high pair of waisted pair of jean shorts or jeans you can also wear that as well and that's a nice spring top that you can wear in the city um, this blouse that I have on, this is the skirt, like this is actually a skirt, not squats, just to show you how nice they are together, so I can wear these with the squat or the skirt, and I'm going to wear that with so much, even like a white shirt, that would look so nice with this Fendi, so many nice mix and match pieces, then I have... Oh, we've already showed you that. Then I have, what should I show you next? This is an old piece I have actually that I was gonna ha take on holiday and I never ended up going, so I'm saving it for this. This is one of my favorite brands that out does all carry. This is Philly Boo. It has a nice like sailor collar, lots of frills. And this is something nice to wear, I think in the evening with a pair of denim shorts for a casual dinner. Um, and this is really nice for me to wear in the summer at home as well and springtime with a pair of jeans. They do really nice. I love a nice, you know, that saying, uh, jeans and a nice top. But actually, it's quite hard to find a nice top. So I really love Philly Boo. Um, always have a bit of Love Shack Fancy in my wardrobe. And I always go for this classic um, style. It's just so wearable. And I have a really sweet little knitwear. Um, to be completely honest with you, when it comes to Love Shack Fancy Knitwear, when they first launched, it was amazing. I was obsessed. Then it got quite popular, and the level of quality rapidly went downhill, and the price was slightly higher as well. Even if it was the same, it was far too expensive for the quality. I was so disappointed because I love all their prints, um, and I think that they've listened to feedback, so I probably wasn't the only one that complained. And the quality is so much better now. It actually feels soft, it feels thick. It's gone back to being nice, thank goodness. So um, this is also from Outdazzle, and you can imagine pairing it with a frilly dress like this, uh, just with a pair of jeans. I'll pop up a picture here, because I have been wearing these Love Shack Fancy Summer Knits since they first launched them, just with a pair of jeans when I'm here, or a pair of leggings, and then when the weather starts getting warmer, I'll put them over a frilly dress, cowboy boots, um, and then I would always take one knit like this on holiday, in case it's a bit breezy in the evening, I'll just take one like this, um, that's nice and summery but warm. And then last but not least, before we share the jeans, I'm taking one long dress, which is a new thing for me. I don't normally wear long dresses, but since um, I had Honoré, I had a nice pink version of this that I got last summer. I also got that from Out Dazzle. So this is the new version. Baby blue is one of my favorite colors. And I definitely, I sized up in this as well because it's buttons down the front. So I'm always a bit conscious of them gaping. But this is a really beautiful dress. I'm gonna love wearing that and it's elasticated at the back which was a huge plus for me why I got this and if you look at all the like the laser cut fabric it's really really beautiful in real life and that would also look really nice with that because it's from the same collection so anything from out that's all don't forget to use the CC 15 when I was linking these for this video I found a new pair of trousers that were brand new in, so I've also ordered those, I'll put up a picture and I'll link them below. They're like kind of like Missoni trousers, long, floaty, I can imagine wearing them on the beach and in the evening with like a long shirt, how nice would they look, because they're transparent where they're for the beach, um, but then imagine with an oversized long shirt, I'll link the shirt by the way that I'm talking about. Um, oh, let me show you the jeans, so I've invested in a pair of new jeans, 
I have had the same pair of jeans since I was 16. I haven't got rid of any. And then I took a load of jeans in to the Luxury Promise Girls because they were all just too small. And then I bought another pair of jeans and they just didn't fit right. This is one of my favorite brands, A Goldie. And I also have them in the denim shorts. So every holiday, pack a pair of denim shorts. You won't regret it. I always pack blue, stonewash and black. I just throw them in there. And for most of the holiday, I end up just wearing my swimsuit and these or the white shirt. That's why I wanted to definitely have a few more frilly bits that were comfortable that I knew I would wear. But I always take a pair of these. I wear all the tops and mix and match. A Goldie are so good. I absolutely love this denim brand. The fit, the quality, the stone wash is always spot on. So these are the ones with the asymmetric. These are actually super flattering if you're a bit bigger around the tummy like me. If you're not, they're super, super flattering. Um, but I actually thought they'd be quite bad for my waistline, but they're, they're actually so good. So they, they're quite tight and fitted. And then because it stops here, I have like all of this loose, so they're actually super comfortable and I'm blown away. I'm waiting for them to do them in black. So really flattering and comfortable because I'm so much bigger around the waist and I'm so much wider that every day I just don't want to wear jeans. They're like, tough, like I like the ones that the, the classic high-waisted, um, but they're too uncomfortable. So these do the trick and I always have a pair of jeans all throughout the year and these are my new ones. Can't recommend them enough. Let's quickly talk about some accessories before we move on to the swimwear and the cover-ups. Um, this is a pre-loved vintage Chanel jacket that I got years and years ago and I bring it out every summer and I tried it on the other day thinking my yellow blazer better fit me because I had to get rid of a couple of my Chanel blazers that I love so much and I just couldn't even get them they didn't even look good undone that's how bad it was pleased to say this still fits me and it looks so nice with my yellow bag that I'm yet to wear because I haven't had a proper holiday um, or like all of us haven't had a proper summer where I've gone out. So this looks so nice with the this denim shorts and a tee, um, the white dress, it's gonna be such a nice look. And there's not that many pieces here and this is definitely a capsule summer wardrobe because everything, no matter what I pull together in this, goes together, which is what a capsule wardrobe is. And you can have anything from beach wear to day wear to evening wear. Um, pair of shoes that I must show you and I wasn't, didn't eat, oh I've hurt my back oh, I'm like an old lady wasn't going to show you these but they were on the floor these are my favourite summer slider I bought these like last minute and I have not stopped wearing them and I, I'm going to order myself, I hope they're still in stock I keep meaning to do it, the, the new baby blue colour but then I was torn between the baby pink but I think I'll go for baby blue I love them True to size, so comfortable. They look so good, like wearing them in the city, but so good for holiday as well. I love them so, so much. They're so comfortable. Now I'm going to turn you around and I'm going to show you all my new swimwear. Just flipped you around there. Um, oh God, driving me crazy that I can't breathe. It's the worst feeling. Um, before we, before I go into this. Whenever I film against here, I get so many messages saying, oh, where's your so-and-so bag? Is it gone? Like, you sold it? Um, no, that's not the case. I'm actually going to have a reshuffle. Normally, I clean this once a week, and then I'll have a reshuffle. Sometimes I take the bags to my flat, or... Um, like, so many people thought I had sold this orange bag. But it's just... it's just, The shelf is a whole hole along this room so it's on the top shelf but yeah it's still here um and then I was filming over here and that bag was there so everyone thought that I'd sold my bronze door well I had a few people ask me that's here whenever I sell something I do actually tell you so um how nice is this for summer as well this and the yellow Chanel I think I'm going to be wearing a lot oh and my white Chanel so let's talk about some swimwear again out dazzle have all like the clothes that I've shown you, plus they have amazing swimwear. The buyers there are always looking for new brands like the Mushi Mouchette, never heard of that ever, which is so unusual for me. Um, and I was talking to them, I was like, oh, I don't know what swimwear to get. Like, 
my body, like the swimwear that I used to use, wear covers zero and I felt very overwhelmed for swimwear. So one of the brands that I love and I have to be comfortable with swimwear and I also like um, ones where I'm supported but I can have like, I don't like getting tan lines here. So this is a new brand, um, Bound by Bond Eye Australia. Australia do the most amazing summer pieces and swimwear. So when they came, I thought, oh, excuse my granny back. I thought there's a big problem here. Like, what is this? And I wish I could try it on for you and show you, but look at this. How tiny is that? I thought, what is going on? They have never sent me a wrong size at Outdazzle. And I thought, okay, always time for first to send me an XS, XXX, XXS. So this is one size, I think. And as soon as you put it on, it completely stretches. It's amazing. So um, yeah, it fits me absolutely fine. This is the kind of swimwear that I like because I can pull it down like this, but then have support. Um, this is one of my favorites actually, because it's a high-waisted. This is the first summer that I'm gonna go away where I've got a high-waisted knicker, which for us girls, it's an on-trend to have, even if you're slim and got a swashboard stomach. Uh, this is the, knicker to have and I love this brown colour and then this comes with a strapless and I've not like got the biggest chest but I'm a 34 double D um, and I have to be careful with strapless because it doesn't give me support they're not padded but there's where it's so stretchy it sucks in so this is a really nice set that's probably my favourite and then I have um what do you call it a one piece because I think I'm definitely, you know, like before I used to love tanning my tummy because I'd always wear like a pair of jeans that would maybe show off my midriff. No one's going to be seeing my tummy, so it's irrelevant if it's got a tan or not. And I think I'll feel a lot more comfortable and I love this bright, bright, bright coral colour and I love this fabric. Reminds me of the um, Pretty Woman outfit. So I saw so many fancy dresses wearing this um, fabric to be a pretty woman. Now... I went off piece then. This, I love. I call it the mermaid thing and I actually think, oh yeah, it is. I think it is actually called mermaid. So um, one of my favorite colors, as you know, this is a cover up. I have never worn cover ups. I've always been, not in love with my body, but I've always felt comfortable that I wear my swimsuit and that's it, or a pair of den denim shorts. I've never had to be like, oh, I need a cover up to make me feel okay around the pool. Now I need a cover up, but then it, mentally I associate caftan in my head as like, like I don't know, like I'm a really uncomf uncomfortable person. So I found it quite challenging. Sorry, every time I film, I'm either can't breathe or I'm itchy. So sorry, I'm gonna try not to itch anymore. So caftan and cover up was a whole new territory for me. And uh, there's a whole section on Out Dazzle where you can look at uh, cover-ups and swimwear and caftans. This is one of the best I've seen. So I can wear this around the pool, on the beach, all the obvious places. And it's so pretty. It's like a pleasure to wear this. It's not like I'm doing it to cover up. And then you have the matching, which you can buy separately. And if I was 10 years younger, or maybe 15 years younger, how nice would this be with a pair of high-waisted jeans? and then you cover it. I'll put the picture up and leave the links because I'm not gonna model this for you. But when I'm on holiday, you tie it up at the front and then with the extra support from this, I would wear this with this bikini. So um, I, you know, you can tie it around a swimsuit or as it is and they're so nice. And then I also got the champagne color as well. So such a nice cover up to wear around the pool just to give you a little bit more confidence and cover up. Lastly, I bought a H&M bikini. Um, you know when you go away, you just want the classic black that ticks all the boxes, has all the support, not as exciting. I found this one um, and it does exactly that. So it has the scallop edge, just a bra bikini with the knicker, which aren't very high waisted. So I think I'm gonna be more inclined to wear the one piece or the high waisted. But I just bought, a brand new black one that fits me and just have it as a safeguard in the suitcase. So I think that is it. I think that's everything I wanted to show you. I don't want to talk too much. Um, 
I bought some new things for Honoré because everything that they grow so quickly, everything that we took to France does not fit him. I'm actually bigger than what I was when I went to France last summer, and which which is so strange. I was very slim after the baby, slimish in the summer, and I think this is my new body, so had to get all new bits. Got lots of new bits for Honoré, I'm not sure if you want to see that. Do let me know, maybe I'll do a story or something. I feel like I'm forgetting something. I think that's it. So now I'm going to try everything on for you. Everything will be linked below in the description box. Um, any questions, let me know. Head over to my Instagram and I'll be sharing in the next couple of days uh, pictures of me wearing this, like even the frilly tops with the yellow blazer. I'm actually going to start wearing some spring things. So if you want any more inspiration, do follow me on there. Um, that's it. So would love it if you would subscribe and I'll see you in my next video. I'm doing my cutaways and I totally forgot about this skirt um, and it does come with like a bralette that I have on order but it looks so good with this. This top looks so good with everything so I thought this was really unusual, asymmetric skirt. Um, I'm out of breath because I've been up and down but yeah beautiful and it looks good with like a white tee or an oversized beige tee I tried it with as well. That's a nice little beach or evening thing. And the other last thing, because it was downstairs, it's just arrived, is this coat by Totem. It smells a bit funny. Um, I also didn't expect it to feel, feel so rough, and you know how I feel about things that are, it's not, it, I would say it's 10% itchy, more than what I would like. And for the price as well, they could have at least not made it itchy. It does have a bit of polyester. Um, and I tried it with a jumper, and it, it was better than on bare skin but um, I do love it with that said this came out in black and I really liked it but I actually prefer the beige I think it's sold out but I will try and link it and find it some somewhere and if I do link it on stories make sure you swipe up immediately because it sells out within literally less than an hour but that was something that I got for spring and I'm wearing that with the new jeans let me lower you down oh that's much better um, so these are the A Goldie jeans. So yeah, I will link this. If it's not in stock, follow me on Instagram. And um, I have linked this once before. And I know that a couple of you managed to grab it. I'm sure they'll get more stock in. That was something a bit silly for me to get it like, as we're approaching spring. But I know I'll wear this in... in uh, I'll wear it this side of the year. What am I saying? I will wear it between now and summer because I live in England but also I'll, wear, I'll be wearing this in autumn as well so yeah definitely the end of the video I filmed all of my cutaways everything looks sensational especially those skort sets really really amazing and I actually really love the knitwear that was really nice and the little white frilly dress I loved it so much I've ordered it in baby blue because I thought it was going to be a bit short but it wasn't it was fine so yeah that's it thank you bye